Hey, what's happening guys? Elton here. I'm in the Ahuntsic sector of the city. Rush hour evening. Still summertime. August 21st. I'm on La Rue Millen. Millen Street. And when I saw it, after a couple of minutes, I realized, I'm like, wait a minute. There used to be a streetcar line, street line called Millen. And, uh... I'm thinking maybe it ran around here. Look at this. Ah, 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 that car that passed was doing 18. It gave it tons, a thumbs up. <laughs> That's cute, man. That's fucking funny. This one also is okay. Woohoo! So, what are we at? Millen and uh, a lot of traffic on this street over here. I don't even know how far the street goes. Eh, looks like it ends over there. That's, that'll be okay. Millen and. Uh, And Legendre. Yes, that's right. For those of you guys who are transit enthusiasts, that's right. The STM uh, garage is over there. The Legendre garage, as it's known, way down there. One day I'll film a, a walk down there. But not today. Today we are on this street here. And I chose this street really at random. And uh, again, I like the name of it because it reminded me of the uh, streetcar service. There used to be, I guess it was around here. I'm not sure exactly, or, anyway, whatever. Typical colorless cars, eh? Dépanneur Marché TD. Mm -hmm. Dépanneur, by the way, is French for convenience store. So as you can see, this, ain't a, this is not a rich neighborhood. This is really a poor, if not working class neighborhood. I'd say more working class blue collar there's an MPV an old MPV that's getting worked on there I thought that's when the MPV got bloated and ugly personally I like I was actually thinking about the old ones the other day that's the ones I like the ones that came out in like 90 89 or whatever those were nice looking vans you know and they also had a 4x4 version of that too you know uh, speaking of older there's a uh, late 90s early 2000s Cherokee eh? Grand Cherokee of course, I'm kidding about the way I pronounce that. It's not Cherokee, it's Cherokee. Oh, wow, there's still white people around here. Huh, how about that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, yes, yes. Yes, woof. <laughs> I know, I know. Maybe she smells my cat. No, she doesn't bite. She doesn't bite, don't worry. So. No, I, oh, what's your name? Bella. Bella. Must be Italiano. Si, Italiano. Si. Still Italians around here, eh? Oh, that's good, that's good. I don't know, sometimes I'm in a certain part of town, and you know when you feel like a minority, it's not good. No, that's good, that's good, that's good. Take care, have a good night. Bye-bye. Okay, Ciao. Bye, buddy. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bella. It's a nice name. It rolls off the tongue. Bella. You know? That's right. There's a lot of Italians that live around here. That's good. Funny how people think I'm Italian. You know, we have the accent. I mean, I'm not Italian. Maybe that's one of the reasons why I'm filming this walk, actually, is to see if I, feel, if I see an old car like this beautiful Lincoln Town car. Look at that. Right away when I'm thinking about a beautiful old car to find or film. And there's one right here, but it's in the driveway. And I don't, I don't go that far, frankly. Look at that. Beautiful. Late 90s, 96, 97, 98 Lincoln Town car. Great condition. Dirty as hell, though. But she's enjoyed. That's good. Tinted glass. That's a rare color around here for this car. That's probably the only one I've ever seen. That's a weird place for a fire hydrant. Then again, look at that. Anyway. Wow, that's great. There you go. For those of you like me, you are addicted to gas guzzling old cars, big American cars. So you can see this is going to be a short walk here. We're almost at the end over there. Uh, I'm trying to think what street that is. I think it's, uh, uh, oh my God, something smells good. I don't know if it's spaghetti or pizza or something. You can see a lot of Italians live around here. Lots of flower pots and flowers and trees. And there's a balloon there floating by me. I don't know why. Yeah, these are popular, right? Eh? Rusted out 2005 and under tech caravan. What a surprise. Uh, what's the street over there? It's um, uh, Sove? Is it Sove? Yes, 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 yes. Uh, no, no, sorry, it's not Sove. It's uh, it's uh, oh hell, I don't know. It's Cremazy. No, it's not Cremazy. I don't know. Fuck. Hmm. Yeah, just a short walk. They can't all be long, you know. Of course, if I was really dedicated, I would double back to where I started and then film the rest of that street. That's a nice color. Very odd Volvo. It's definitely not a successful car. Definitely not, but I like colors, you know. See, again, if this is all Italians live around here, they're all the colorful cars. I love that about these people. God bless them. Seriously. 
uh, I don't know, sometimes I think there's a lot of colorless cars because some people are of a different type of uh, ethnicity. It's just not, they don't fucking care about colors. I don't know. Oh, well, you probably think I'm a racist at this point. I don't fucking care. I'm just making a, 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 I'm not assuming something. I'm just making a hypothesis. All right, what the hell street am I on here finishing my thing over here? Anyway, I'm sure if I did some research, I would find actually that maybe the street, there was a streetcar that ran right here. Actually, that would make sense because as I mentioned, the STM Garage Legend is down there, bus garage. They fix the metros, and before there were metros in service, it was a streetcar. So they house and fix streetcars like some other garages. Oh, that's where we are. We are at Emile Journeau. What a weird name. Because Journeau is... Uh, Journeau is almost like plural for newspaper. And I just want to finish by a car I see here. Looks like a Supra. What is that? In front of, in the back of that... Uh, that uh, water tanker or whatever it is. Man, I'm really curious about that car, man. C'est quoi ça là là? As a matter of fact, in front of it, it looks like an old GMC Top Kick on top of that. That's a Corvette. On Emile Journeau. It is an old Top. No, it's an F800. Holy shit. Look at that. It says water truck on it. Oh, you know that thing's not from Quebec. There's no way. It says fucking water truck on it. And anyway, these F700, F800 Fords were never common around here in those particular years. That's fucking weird. I like that. Anyway, that's it. That's all. Uh, wishing you, wherever you are, a nice day, a nice evening uh, to all you good people out there. And a special thank you for all my loyal subscribers who I really feed off of all your positive uh, comments, vibes, whatever you want to call them. Finish with a plane landing here. Where is it? Where is that? There it is. Here, Canada. Adios, folks.